What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. And we've got a little bit more information about another expansion coming to Red Dead Online from a Take 2 executive. Now, I think this is good news and bad news at the same time. And the reason I think this is because the executive from Take 2 did say there will be another major update coming to Red Dead Online, which will be an expansion on the frontier pursuits that we have. I'm not sure if this is meaning we're going to get a new expansion or if this means that we're going to get things added to the Frontier Pursuits, the roles we already have available. It sounds more like that. Uh, you know, we're going to get these things added to what we already have in game, but there was no more detail given. The bad news about this is he said we can expect this update before April 2021, which means if we have to wait until next spring for another update, it's going to kind of be like it was in the past. We're going to be waiting four, five, six, seven, eight months for an update. And a lot of people really get discouraged with the online mode when it comes to just kind of a drought when it comes to consistent content. I was really hoping we were going to get more consistent content with the game now that the Naturalist update come out, has come out. I feel like, and this may not be the case, but it feels like Rockstar and Take-Two have the exact same people working on GTA Online and Red Dead Online. It seems like you get an update for one or the other, never multiple updates for each of these games i'm not sure what the case is but it just feels like that a lot in my opinion they did say there's a major update coming out for gta online which is the biggest one they've ever had so i'm assuming we probably won't get any more red dead online news until this update for gta is released they did also mention that they had sold 32 million copies of the game to date which means there's a lot of people still interested in the game. I know a lot of these people are buying to play the story, which is absolutely incredible. The single player is one of the better single players uh, kind of of this generation, in my opinion. The, the This was a great, great story. I really enjoyed it. But I think a lot of these people kind of trickle into the online mode and either get discouraged with it because of all the error codes and bugs or lack of content, or just are kind of worried about playing it in general, maybe because they had a bad experience with GTA Online. I'm not sure what the case is. But it shows you there's still people interested in the game. Of course, there's still people purchasing on PC. It hasn't been out that long on uh, PC compared to console. But I was just, I was really excited to hear this news that we're going to get another large expansion. Uh, another large expansion. I was just kind of disappointed to hear that it was going to be before April 2021. Does this mean we're not going to get small expansions in between now and the next large expansion? No, we could get, we could get that kind of content. And that's what I was kind of hoping for. I'm hoping it goes in that direction. I'm hoping we get consistent updates monthly and maybe, you know, a, a big update every three months. I, I don't think that's really too much to ask. <laughs> you know, you, two or three big updates a year and consistent bug fixes month in and month out, I think would improve the game greatly. Of course, there have also been a few rumors about Undead Nightmare. Now you can take all this with a grain of salt. These are just rumors, but there's a rumor that there's some kind of content coming to Red Dead Online that revolves around un, uh, the Undead Nightmare mode from Red Dead Redemption. Like I said, like I said, this is just rumor, but I think it would be a great idea to add something in like that for the Halloween event. Last year, of course, we got to buy some masks from Madame Lazar during uh, Halloween time. Wouldn't it be awesome if the whole month of October we got some kind of Red Dead online Undead Nightmare event in the game? I think that would be absolutely awesome. That's just my opinion on what I'd like to see. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. And if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to click the bell icon if you are a subscriber up in the top right corner. That way you know when all my videos go live. And be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate GT Racing. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.